projects. We do them every day, but we never expect them to turn into life and death situations. A fire ripped through two homes in Novi just a few months ago. And although the official cause is not out yet, investigators say spontaneous combustion may be to blame. Yeah, instant infernos like these happen all the time, surprisingly. 7 Action News reporter Aaron Baskerville is here with the dangers. Someone inside the house told investigators that they were just doing home improvements using a common product called linseed oil. After that, they just tossed the rags inside, and that started a giant inferno. Flames shooting 30 feet into the sky. Opened up the door and got hit in the face with a wall of smoke. Spontaneous combustion, it's real. Mike and Sherry Prentice know firsthand. There was about $60,000 worth of damage. Prentice used linseed oil on her wood furniture, then, like many, picked up the mess and tossed the oil soaked rags in a corner of the couple's garage. That was at about 5 o'clock p.m., and by 9 o'clock p.m. that night, our garage was on fire. The fire tore through their garage and the two cars inside. Fortunately, no one was injured. It can create just enough heat to, to, to start on fire. It is linseed oil. It's fairly safe in its liquid form, but doesn't take much to turn it into a giant inferno. Outside temperatures, anything like that, do not factor into it. It's all uh, the chemical reaction inside the rag or inside the can that it's in. We decided to see for ourselves with the help of Dearborn Heights firefighters. We set up the scene with linseed oil, rags, drop cloth, and rubber gloves. We finished our staining project, cleaned up the mess, and threw it all in a box and waited. Within just a few hours, we started seeing smoke. The infrared thermometer showed the temperature inside the box above 300 degrees Fahrenheit, and just a short time later, fire erupted. You know, it doesn't happen every time you do something. You know, if we'd have done the same thing, Ten times, probably nine times, nothing would have happened. But it was just, you know, the, if you get unlucky the one time, um, it can can have some pretty serious consequences. It all depends on the chemicals you use. Linseed oil is a really high combustible. Uh, other stains and varnishes have the potential, but are not as dangerous. But they could always happen. And where you put those rags after is the key. The best thing to do would be to lay the rags out in a safe. Uh, well vent ventilated area. Let it dry for at least 24 hours. Uh, make sure the cloths or any drop cloths or newspaper that you're using are dry. And then you can put them in a, a sealed plastic bag and dispose them in, in the regular garbage. Then after that, you should not even put them inside your house, not even your garage. Aaron Baskerville, 7 Action News. Wow, really good information.